Howdy people! Today in this video I'd like to show you guys how to create a simple hello world page. So we're going to be creating controller. First we're going to create a router and then we're going to get a controller in action and possibly blade. Okay so let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to open my browser. This is my home page and if I do Hello, as you can see, there's nothing available because we haven't created one. So I'd like to create a hello. When I type developer slash hello, I want to see hello world here. Okay, so let me open my PHP Storm. First thing I'd like to do is I'm going to go open my, my route PHP. Okay, so here we're going to open, we're going to write route we're going to say hello and then here we're going to um, create an index controller and action we're going to say say hello okay so now I'm gonna save that now if I go back and refresh the button okay so we're still getting uh, page cannot be displayed because we haven't created our index yet now next thing is we have this route name called hello it's pointing to this controller and to this action okay so now we're going to create this controller we can take advantage of PHP artisan okay and that create index controller right there Okay, can open up. Uh, we do have the class, which we have the controller. Uh, uh, now we have to create this say hello action. So what we can do, we're going to create a public method. Say hello. For now, we're going to return. We're going to return hello world here and save it. Okay, so now if I go back to my page and refresh, now we see say hello world. It's displaying right here. Okay, so right now it is displaying from the controller. Um, that's not the best practice that's not how we're supposed to do it but I just wanted to show you guys you can display it from as well you can return the value here so now let's go ahead uh, create our blades okay so here our blades are located in resources and views folder right in here what I like to do I like to create a new file okay then I'm gonna call hello dot blade dot PHP okay I have that now inside here you can have you know HTML whatever hello world okay then we can say break here and then say you can put H Three. Um, this is a view. Uh, it's called blade. Okay. So we're gonna save that, and then I will come back here. Now we're gonna remove this portion, and we're gonna say view, and then we need to specify what blade we're gonna be displaying this. So now when I refresh it, 
actually when I save this and come back to my browser there you go so now we have you open that source view hello world this is a blade okay now another quick thing is since we already hear what we can do say we have uh, a variable called name and the name is John Kashmatov I like to pass this to my blade and display it that variable in the blade so I can do compact and name that's one way to do it or you can do width okay then inside you can pass the variable but I prefer the compact version okay and then if I go back here instead of saying hello world I'm gonna open up the, the curly bracket for uh, blades which is displays the variables so in, inside I'm gonna say name now if I go back here and refresh it says hello John Tashmatov so this value actually is passed from controller that gives you an idea uh, so pretty much you can do everything all right that's about it so let's try different things now thanks for watching